in the first ever matchup here at FedEx Field, Army and Navy take it away for the 112th time. Let's take a look at the action here in the first quarter. Barack Obama here at hand, shaking hands, kissing babies, all is well at FedEx Field. And as you see, the Navy midshipmen really taking it to the Black Knight defense with the triple option attack as they have all season. But it was Army that surprised everyone, tying the game at 14 and 14 at half. Starting in the second half, Army even got some momentum as both teams shared a touchdown each, making it 21-21. But then here come the Navy midshipmen, taking it all the way down to their red zone, but getting stopped twice by the stingy Army defense. Then in the second half, it was two field goals by the midshipmen as they took the victory 27-21 here at FedEx Field. After the game, we had some player interviews and how the Navy midshipmen got their 10th straight victory. Just being able to just keep the tradition going and get it, for, get it for the seniors, so it's just a blessing to keep winning. You know, there's so much history to this game. Um, such a big rivalry for both these institutions, really. Um, just for me and these seniors, seniors, it means so much to get this last one. Bowl games and Commander and Chiefs trophies, they're all special, but in the end, it all comes down to this game, and winning this is no, makes it feel no, no better. After sealing another victory here in Landover, the Navy midshipmen look on to next year to see if they can have a better record against an even tougher team in Army next December. For a part of the review, I'm Mike McCoy.